um, from the Bible, from the New Testament, from the New Testament, from the words of Jesus Christ himself, from the first eyewitnesses of Jesus Christ, from his followers, his companions, that he claimed to be the Son of God. He claimed things which, which in an Islam... Masha, until that moment in history, Jesus was viewed by many of his followers as a mighty prophet, as a great and powerful man, but a man, a mortal man. Not the son of God? Not even his nephew twice removed. Not even his nephew twice removed. Not the son of God? Not even his nephew twice removed. Well, hold on. You're saying Jesus' divinity came from a vault? Well, remember in those days, gods were everywhere. By infusing Jesus the man with the divine magic, by making him capable of uh, earthly miracles, as well as his own resurrection, Constantine turned him into a god, but within the human world. And he basically knocked the more distant gods out of the game. Facts for many Christians. Jesus was mortal one day and divine the next. Understanding will be completely, completely foreign. It's foreign to Muhammad. Muhammad never understood who Jesus was. It's foreign to this book known as the Quran. Um, did did Muhammad understand who Jesus was? Well, no, he didn't. Why is that? Well, I will be explaining that shortly. Uh, this is just an introduction. Um, I give really, um, I give a lot of thanks to those Christians out there who are not afraid to proclaim the gospel of Jesus Christ. I praise God for those Muslims, ex-Muslims, who who've come to faith.